this 50 go? Don't drink and try. What's up YouTube? We're back at it again. We just got a package dropped off from FedEx and what we have here is my carbon fiber graphic overlay kit. Let's get this bad boy opened up and see what's inside. We get this bad boy open. All right, we have the installation instructions and what to do. This is all the stuff that the kit comes with. I'm not going to be using all of it because um, I have a California special. And some of the stuff comes from the factory are already on there. I will be using this. This right here is where my shifter goes. And this is like the trunk release button. The hazard lights. And I think the uh, the traction control button goes right here. So I'm most definitely be using this. I will be using this. For the radio, it'll go something like this. This is for automatic, so I won't be using this piece right here. Probably sell it on Craigslist or something. This is for the uh, other style radio. I won't be using this. And this is for my dash, I think. I don't know what this is. Dash and something else. Oh, this goes up here to light control switch. I'll be using this. Let me take a look and see if I have this stuff for my dash. Okay, I won't be using this. Mine has this already. I will be using this. I think this is for the steering wheel. The, the buttons on the steering wheel. I will be using this right here. This is the door vent trims where the uh, the frost comes to the windows through the doors. Like I said, this is the uh, your overhead light switch the map part. I'll be using that. I don't know what this is right now. To figure that out, so I don't know if I'll be using that or not. Once you get your sticker on, the wrap on, you just want to squeegee the moisture out of it. You can see it coming out. You could use a, a, a heat gun or a blow dryer too. That's what I'll probably wind up doing to help it dry out since it's not that hot outside. You see the water coming out. So what I'm going to do is just spray some degreaser cleaner, clean it off. Then once you clean it off, just want to get you some alcohol. I put some alcohol in here and then spray it down 
All the parts you're gonna do, spray it down, spray it down, spray it down. What I have here is a little bit of dish soap and water mixed together. Spray a little bit on there just so you can have the, the vinyl slide around a little bit so until you get it in the place you want it. Okay, you lay it down there. Get it to where you want it at. That's why you put the, the water on there so you can slide it around. And then once you're happy where, where you have it at, just want to start squeezing the excess water out. See it coming out. All right, I got everything installed. That's a piece I did. Like I said, I have a California special. So my this. dash already came with that carbon fiber already on it. That. I did this piece. I did that piece. That piece. That piece. that piece I did that piece I did this did the same on the door I did it on the door I just showed you and I did the light. These are some pieces I have left. This is for our automatic. This piece is part of the gauge cluster. I still don't know what these two pieces go to. Just don't know what they go to. Put him up here. And then we have uh, this right here is for a convertible. It's the uh, dome lights. This is for the um, turn the lights on with the traction control and uh, track pack stuff. I already have all that. That's part of the gauge clusters. That's for a convertible too. Don't know what this goes to. This goes to the AC vents. It's part of the cluster. And this right here is part of the cluster too. Don't need that. And then I have two radio bezels. They look the same, but if you look at this one right here, it has some buttons for something. All right, there you go.